page. This is Johnny Gordiva. So my niece is holding the camera. She's awesome. This is the same girl who came out to me recently. So I'm really, really excited. I'm glad that she's here. Um, so I received a few comments on my video from yesterday saying that they were concerned about um, kind of the way that I portrayed, you know, being a chub in today's society, as well as kind of some of the comments that I made about chasers. Um, first of all, I, I love myself. So anybody who says that I'm being incredibly negative and that I hate myself for being a chub, you got it all wrong. Um, I grew up where people treated me differently for being big, for being a big person. Um, and I was, a, like I said, they avoided me. They um, called me names. You know, they basically said, you were not good enough to treat like a normal person who is skinny. Um, and then being around gay twinks who are attracted to chubby guys, you know, they don't even try to give you the time of day. They're not kind to you. And not all gay twinks, I should say that. Um, but there is a, a, how do you wanna, how do I wanna put it? There is a group um, and they're the dramatic ones. They're the ones that are gonna tear you down um, just so that they can feel better kind of a thing or just to get, just to basically maintain a reputation. Um, so don't feel scared of getting into the gay scene because of that, but be aware of that and actually build yourself up in case that happens to where you just kind of let it roll off your back, basically is what I'm saying. Um, as for the comments on chasers, um, I know that I said that there are chasers who like to fucking run, and there are. And that's just, and, and that's just life. There are chubs that are the same way. There are typical gay guys that are like that. There are straight people who are like that. I am not saying that all chasers are that way. However, there is this subgroup, because there's been more than one that I've been in contact with, of chasers that have a phone number or, excuse me, a phone full of numbers of all these various guys that they call their friends, but the only time they ever hang out is when they wanna fuck. So no, that's not your friend, that's your fuck buddy. And you only hang out with them when you want to fuck. So, you know, yesterday, my intent for the video was not to bash anybody. My intent for this channel is not to bash anybody. It is just to talk about my experiences. I know that my wording has been, a, you know, off in the last video because I said you a lot. Um, and I apologize about that and I'm taking that into consideration. And I'm going to try to focus on my experiences and this is what's happened to me. Um, because that's my intent for the channel is to show my perspective. Um, now, if you are offended by anything that I say, I will apologize and I'm sorry that you got offended. Will I apologize for what I said? No, I will not. These are my opinions. I am expressing myself. I will say what has happened to me through my experiences. And I there, there are more than one um, chasers out there who they just fuck and run. Not a lot of them, there really isn't, but there is more than one. Um, you know, when I can go onto any chub chaser site and talk to five different chubs, at least three out of five chubs know that person, if not on a sexual level, at least have talked to them. And I know that doesn't sound, I, and I know that, you know, a lot of people have talked to a lot of chasers and chubs. However, my point being is these are, these, these specific guys are very well known. And um, so my point being is when you're already dealing with the fact that you're overweight, um, that you're getting this attitude from twink gay guys,
where they don't want anything to do with you because they don't find you attractive to a certain chaser that is attracted to you but you're only going to be around when they want to fuck it kind of starts fucking with your head a little bit or at least it fucked with my head let me put it that way but I know that I'm not the only one that, that's done it to because I've talked to other people if you look on these sites you see people commenting and saying the same thing so that's what I want to say and if you feel that I'm bashing all chasers I'm not because trust me I love chasers they're they love me and it's awesome however you have to be willing to acknowledge that there are douchebags as there are douchebag chugs and I am willing to admit that so you know that's kind of what I